so we have not posted in a minute the reasoning is that life has been busy we realized though we're like wait i'm gonna take this off basically yeah. we came to the conclusion that when life's busy like that's when we need to be recording because there's a lot of exciting things happening but we didn't so but we didn't and we have some exciting news so we're obviously sitting in a different bedroom right now because we moved to Europe. <laughs> no, we bought a house. Ta -da! Yeah, so super, super excited about that. I feel like it's been like a dream of mine since I was so small. Yeah, and... it's, it's really been crazy. It's August right now. We've been in the house since about mid-May. Mid -May. So it, it. So we're really behind. This already has been a little bit like of a working project. We have some like rooms in progress. Like this is actually one that we've made more progress on. We're like painting the inside. I mean, we'll show you all the updates. My mom was down here probably beginning of March. She wanted to move down here in the future. So she was like, hey, we just kind of look at neighborhoods and kind of look around. And we, of course, have been renting. So we saw a bunch of houses. We were like, these are, these are kind of nice. So we were like not in the position to obviously be looking at all. Like we weren't even thinking about it. I mean, back of our heads, but not thinking about it. I was looking like kind of as your mom was looking, like that kind of got me into looking because like as a kid, I loved going onto like the house websites and just seeing the different areas. This was the first house we looked at. Like this was the first, first house one that made my list. Put in. Yeah. Yeah. And we were like, wow, this one's good. We visited two others that day and like they were nice, but like this one, I don't know. We just kept thinking back to it. And then we viewed some others in the different neighborhoods because we wanted to be making like an educated decision. We don't, we felt like, oh, why are we gonna go with the first house we looked at? Like that's so impulsive almost. So anyways, we put an application for this home and we didn't get it. We got rejected. We got rejected. We were close, but we got rejected. And of course, yeah. if you know the housing market of Florida, there was an outside investor that wanted to kind of flip the home, rent it out, whatever. And I don't know where it fell through, like, but ultimately they decided, like, no, deal's off the table, like, we don't want to do this anymore. So the homeowners called us back and we're like, are you still interested? And at this point, like, nothing else had come up and we're kind of like, okay, we're going to rent again for another year. And so we were so excited. <laughs> okay, kind of uh, another big note that we almost forgot to say, <laughs> we live in St. Pete. Okay, so this is where you walk into the house and you actually kind of walk right into our family room. Um, but I'll share this wall first because at first I was like, hmm, like what, what's going on here with the windows? And I was like, should we knock it down, open it up? But I instantly was like, wow, this would be really cute with my plants on it. And look how cute it looks. And then we're gonna like put like a little entryway bench. Um, but this one's really like vining and I think it's just gonna be really cute and kind of like charming, like, you know, a little character added. We have painted three rooms so far. We plan on painting the entire inside of our house white because, I mean, you can kind of see behind. It was like, kind of like this blue-gray color because we're on like, it's just one story and it's like a darker color. It just felt really dark in here. Even this room feels just so much brighter. It matches the furniture more and like once we get wall decor up and everything, I feel like we're gonna have um, some like warmth added back in with the white color. So we'll spin and look at the family room where we enter. So this is the family room. And I mean, some of the stuff like we want to swap out, but we're just, I mean, you'll notice some of the stuff is the same from our apartment because a lot of the furniture we took over. We've also bought a lot on Facebook marketplace. So like this couch, but for right now, this is what we have. Um, I think obviously we need some like wall art and little things like Dylan's gonna do a project and put the cords behind the wall um, and obviously just a lot more like decor around the entire room. So I look good? You look great. Okay, all right, this is, you're stepping into our sacred dining room. This is actually a beautiful table. I absolutely love this table. It was a Facebook marketplace find. Um, It was a Facebook Marketplace find. Kristen did a fantastic job finding this. I think it fits. At first, we thought it was going to be too big. It's no. not. It's perfect. We absolutely love it. Kristen has an idea of kind of putting a bench right here, a bench that kind of spans across. Millie loves to look out the windows and all the birds, cats, people. 
Um, and I think it would just kind of be nice to have this space be able to be utilized. Uh, bienvenido a mi cocina. Welcome to my kitchen. So I am so excited about this kitchen because I feel like our one before, I mean, they're probably similar-ish sizes, but it just felt small. It was very dark and like the white cabinets I loved. And then the kitchen island actually came with the house. I think it's from like Ikea because I saw it when I was on there. We even have some of our, you know, kitchen stuff and it looks cute in there. So I'm really excited about this space. So basically like this has some, projects that would be something that we would do like later in the future like we talked about changing up the backsplash a little bit i like the blue but i don't know we might we might switch it out it's just like a perfect size for both of us we're excited to like be able to properly host people because in our apartment it was so tight and whenever a family would come it just felt a thousand times smaller where it's like wow here we can make dinners with people we can have people at our dining table so this is on the other wall of our kitchen and we just got this cart from Ikea, which I'm really excited about because now we have access to this outlet, which was floating in the middle of the wall. So it basically needed a cart like this, but I think it might be like a little baking station slash kind of like holiday decor. We could have holiday mugs. It could be a hot cocoa station. Like I feel like it's a spot that we can add some more personality to our kitchen. And I don't know, I'm excited about it. Okay. This is like a hallway of doors. This is, yeah, uh, I don't, this is not going to be fun to paint. There's a lot of stuff in here. There's a lot of doors. So which door would you like to open up first? The right door or the left door? Dee -dee 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 -dee. Okay, left door. So in here we have um, kind of, I, I, I guess, so the house is laid out weird. This is technically the main bathroom we use besides showering because... This tub is, it's a, it's a little weird, okay? So first off, I just feel like my, both of my shoulders kind of will touch both sides. <laughs> and then the way the air flows in here, this will stick to you when you're taking a shower. So literally you'll be like this. This will be on top of you. The water's coming down. The tub is, it, it's a little weird. It kind of feels it's like you're a little you're, gross. You're and sinking. that was clean. Like it's, it's just kind of stained. Sinking. It's kind of gross. This tub's gonna need to be changed. I don't mind this side. I think that this side's kind of. I think there's workable. things like I would maybe switch out the lights. I might get rid of the medicine cabinet because it just juts out a lot. Change out the mirror. Like there are things for sure. Right. But. I mean, is it big enough for me to take a bath? Oh, it is. It's just it kind of grosses me out a little bit. You know it what I mean? Does like kind of gross me out. I. I mean, I it's know. not gross if you clean it, but I just yeah. Yeah. So anyway, so. It's a three bedroom, two bath. This is bathroom number one. Yeah. And let's make our way to bedroom number, oh no. We have like our little sand dollars that we found at the beach here because we don't really use the soap bar. So basically we're just beach decor there. On the way to our bedroom, we have my favorite area of the house, which is our linen closet. It's absolutely fantastic. Yeah, we have to organize it still. <laughs> it's where I spend most of my time, I would probably say. And then second most time that I probably spend in this house is our second linen cl closet. It's not as nice as that one, um, but I, you know, it still does the job for me. So if you're lucky. <laughs> weekend it was one of the rooms that we were painting and quickly got a bed frame and a, our old mattress and so it's pretty plain it's kind of boring but it's like the same thing as all the other rooms where it just needs like decor like it's once we're done painting I can actually like focus on the decor and personalizing it and making it just feel more homey but for right now we have somewhere for guests to sleep which is the most important um also I thought I would mention these came with our house and they're just really pretty blind so I was really excited about that that was one of the things I liked this is our master bedroom Millie would you like to show them around she's queen oh, oh okay she's <laughs> Anyways, this is our master bedroom. We'll talk about why we chose this room, um, I guess, later when we show what technically would be the master bedroom. 
Um, thank you, Millie. I really appreciate this. Yes, don't worry. We'll, we'll talk about all of that. Um, this is our master bedroom. I really like it a lot. Obviously, we still have some work in progress here. We still need to paint in here. We need to put a TV up on the wall, but to be honest, I kind of liked not having a TV in here. Um, yeah, it's been nice just to kind of have this as just our decompress and wind down room, but obviously there's still some work that needs to go into it. My side of the bed is a little bit dirtier than Crystal's, but that's we okay. We won't show it. We got new bed, same bed I... frame. Obviously, I think that the way that Crystal did it is she wanted it to be white, and I think this will match all of it a lot better. It's not white yet. It's the going walls. to be white soon. And when it is white on the wall, it will look more white and more better. <laughs> I don't I don't think there's a better way that I could have described that. Do we dare show our closet? I mean, yeah, it's definitely it's not as big as like our our other closet, that's for sure. Oh my oh. god. <laughs> don't look. That's my underwear that's hanging up. I just did laundry. <laughs> Millie, I told you to put that away. What are you doing leaving that headphone job? Let's go that way! Okay, so now we're walking in from the dining room. So we're back in the other corner of the house. And we have, first off, these beautiful French doors, which I really like. Um, and they open up into this room, which we debated on having it be the master bedroom because there's a bathroom off of it. But the whole thing is that this is our only way, like from the main house besides the garage, out back. So it was like, okay, if we have guests here, they're always gonna be walking through our bedroom to go out back. And then also you would have had our office and our guest bedroom on the other side of the house. And we just felt like maybe we wouldn't go in the office then and we'd always be kind of kept on this side of the house. So we just decided to make it this kind of like open space office type thing. Um, so we've got my little like vanity desk that we might replace at some point with a larger desk for Dylan's request. Um, but it's kind of like somewhere that we can film, work, just kind of like a hobby kind of room too if that makes sense. Um, but also this was one of the other ones that's been painted so I love it because it just looks good with the wood floor and just my decor. So I've got this little like clothing rack up in here, we've got a mirror, we've got a little plant who made it through the move because some were a little bit neglected and didn't make it. Um, and then obviously the desk space, which it just has like a bunch of random things up there because they were all in shelving and again we haven't like hung any of that stuff up so we don't quite have places for that to go. I also thought I would mention our ugly tile. Um, yeah. So it just kind of looks drabby and old. I don't know. We have like plants. We kind of want to cover it in with like wood somehow. Dylan's going to figure it out somehow. And then we have the bathroom off of this. So it's small but mighty. Um, and it's actually where we shower because the shower is just so much nicer. In here. I really like it. I'm like not overly a fan of these medicine boxes for some reason or medicine cabinets for some reason, but it works for now. Like this one, you know, it's nice. Okay, this was probably one of the reasons why I love the house the most. Dude. She's excited to go outside. We lucked out and got this big, beautiful backyard. Um, maybe not big for like New York, but big, big for Florida. This is a Facebook marketplace find. Um, it opens up even to make it bigger. I need to kind of sand it some more and stain it, but when it hopefully it cools down a little bit more, we'll be able to have more, be able to have <laughs> more like lunches and dinners and uh, eat out here more. Sometimes it's hard like when you're eating a burger and you're like sweating over it. Um, it's not as fun, but we do spend time out here. Um, out here, another Facebook marketplace find is like this beautiful outdoor set. Came with two swivel chairs. Oh, couch. there's a chair over there. For some reason, there's a chair over here. Um, and I'm really proud of this. You can't really see, but underneath here is like I also a TV. love our fan. There's a TV here, okay? I mounted this TV all by myself outside. I did all these string lights. Some people may say it's a little tacky, but at night it looks... It, it does. It's cozy, and it's always it, something that we can decide to do something different with later on, because I like it. Fireplace table. I don't know how much we'll use it. It's not 
really our style 100%, but I think it, it, it comes together, it the looks nice. Place, yeah. This is like Millie's like Wild West. Um, it looks weird around the edges, doesn't it? Well, that's because as of like yesterday, there was a chain link fence there. For some reason, past owners, not only did they have a really nice white fence around the outside, but they decided to put a chain link fence. I think it was that. the owners before that, but. Anyways. Chrislyn's brother was nice enough to help us, well, help us. He literally took down the chain link fence themselves. That we just have the post really up there. really weird noise from Millie over there. I'm gonna go check that. We still have like a lot of work to do around these edges and stuff like that. And obviously the posts removed. The posts need to get removed, there's weeds. Millie's gonna find a rock right there, which is gonna make her very, very, very happy. Um, she's and us. a rock thief. She's an absolute rock thief. Not but anyways, it's perfect to play fetch with her. Um, we need to take these posts down, kind of fill in this area, and we need to add a post, um, we need to add a fence, white fence along this side. Um, we got a shed right here, which is where we store all of our equipment. I got a lawnmower, which is every guy's dream, right? Oh, what the heck? I was talking! What, would you like it if I just went like this to you? I think she would. No. Oh, anyways. I got a pressure washer, um, and I've like pressure, really? <laughs> pressure washed a lot Dude. of concrete um, in here to make it look brighter and newer. Um, the back here is brick. Um, I like the oh. brick. Millie's gonna take a crap right now. Um, <laughs> we like the brick, we do, um, but we're thinking about. Ugh. <laughs> we're thinking about painting it. What did you have to eat that caused it to look like that? We're thinking about painting it white. Um, we do think that it would look very nice white. I mean, it's controversial to paint it white, but... And another longer term project, we have to do kind of something, something like this right here. Millie's, Millie's barking at a piece of metal, so just ignore her. Um, in here is a room that you might think, what the heck is this? Well, that's because that's exactly what we're thinking. What the heck is this in here? We have this weird enclosed room, and that makes Crystal well, think- Well, it's like broken screen, mind you. Right. What does every person in Florida absolutely need? That, that's right, you guessed a hot tub. I mean, who in Florida doesn't need a hot tub? And while that does sound crazy, I feel like we could use a hot tub from like October to maybe even like May. Um, Chrislyn also likes the idea in the summer of just not turning it on and just laying in it like a bath, which I think is kind of gross. We don't know what this is. Um, it, it's... I was like, oh, it's handicap accessible, but then I was like, it's a step? I don't know. It's not handicap accessible. For some reason, I feel like this was built lower and this was built higher, so they needed to make a space for the door to be opened up. Um, but yeah, that is our backyard, and we absolutely love it. So that's our house and I'm so excited for when we do like our next house tour because it's actually gonna be like decorated and really probably like lived in for a few years. We got lots know. of we got lots of projects to do, but it's gonna be a lot of fun. I'm super excited. Yeah. I'm just saying like our well, I feel like going I feel like when we film our like decorated house tour and it's not just like wow we just moved in, it's gonna be really fun to like look back at this one, you know what I mean? And it's just our little home. Anyways, so um, we got more videos coming out, lots of more exciting news even after this, um, and thanks for watching our house tour. Yeah, thank you. Bye. Bye.